But first, I want to go to the man behind uh, the other side of the computer or the show or whatever you want to call it. We've got our producer extraordinaire working the Matouche magic, Mr. Nathan Matouche. Hello, sir. How are you, my friend? Hey, I'm doing good, Jimmy. How are you doing? You know, not too shabby. Been pretty busy of late. Things have been kind of crazy, but, you know, we're here. We're ready to talk. I've got some great interviews to share, and I'm excited. I'm excited, too. It's an honor to be back. Uh, I've been gone for months. It's, it's good to feel the, the Matouche magic back in the air, especially here at Jimmy at the Crossroads. Right? I know. Unfortunately, it's not going to be too much longer because you have a venture that you are about to go on. And I wanted to take a moment, give everybody the chance to hear for a minute or two about the mission that you're about to embark on. Feel free to take a moment, and then uh, we'll also give people some information on how they can connect if they want to support you. Yeah, yeah, you bet, Jimmy. Um, so as you know, and um, as I've been telling some other people, I'm becoming a focus missionary. Uh, and if people haven't heard of that, it stands for the Fellowship of Catholic University Students. So my main target as a missionary is going to be College students, um, students uh, usually in their in their you know late teens, early twenty years. Um, that's the main demographic that I'm going to be working with. Um, and I actually got back from training. I was up in uh, Bismarck, North Dakota, for a bit and um, training to become a focus missionary. We did masses every day, daily masses. Had an opportunity to do a silent retreat and uh, just hear the voice of uh, my Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Um, it was phenomenal. I, I loved uh, every moment of it. And, you know, just meeting, like, friends that, like, you literally meet, like, one day and you're all of a sudden just best friends. You know, God takes care of his people, and I think that's uh, what was great about it. Um, but I got placed at a college campus, so I'm going to be at Fort Hayes State out in uh, Hayes, Kansas. So I'm pumped. I'm looking forward to it. Um, I got my team and everything. And, uh, yeah, like, as I was saying, Jimmy, there there is a crisis in the church, um, definitely. And I, that's, that's, there's not a lot of young people in the Catholic church today. And uh, I mean, the statistics like say, like, I mean, right here, I think this says it all, you know, 78% of Catholics leave the Catholic faith by the age of 24. And I mean, I think a lot of it is, you know, kind of the college life, the party life, you know, the atmosphere, um, and stuff like that. And so my, my goal is to, you know, really touch these students' hearts. And, uh, you know, Jesus is going to speak through me. Um, I'm going to be doing different Bible studies and, um, you know, different activities leading discipleships and uh, all sorts of stuff just to uh, create that fellowship. Um, and I think it, it kind of ties into my story as well. You know, I went to college and, you know, I kind of just went to school, went home. Um, I didn't really connect with a lot of people um, in college, and I wish I did. I wish I would have had, you know, something like um, something like focus with uh, fellowship and you know, brotherhood and uh, that Bible study. So definitely, I think uh, that's a whole reason why I'm doing this. Um, and uh, I'm just looking forward to it. Like, I can't I can't wait. Well, I'm proud of you for taking on this mission. And it, it's always a challenge when you are trying to evangelize, but it is a challenge that you are clearly suited for and called to do. How can folks support you? Is there a way that they can help you out with this mission? Um, yeah, I, I think uh, mainly I want to um, get people like sit down people um, individually and um, just have a conversation just more um, about my mission. Um, I'd say the best way is, you know, phone number or email um, to start. And then um, from there, I could send people my support page um, as well and see if they'd be interested in being part of my um, mission support team. Um, so, yeah, I'd say my phone number and my email is the best so way to do that. So I'm going to suggest, that. since that information isn't publicly accessible, if anybody is interested in helping learn or just learning more about what Mr. Matouche is doing, going to be working in the Matouche magic for the Lord coming up soon, <laughs> um, please go, log on to jimmyatthecrossroads.com. That's jimmyatthecrossroads.com, our website for the show. You can go to the contact page and shoot me an email, and I will get you in touch with Nathan. Or hey, Nathan, you can also share your email address if you want to do that. Don't want to give your phone on the on the air. Yeah, yeah. Email address uh, you can reach me at uh, here. I'll put up my lower third here, you know, so we can uh, have that at least to to go off of. Um, you can follow me on Twitter at, as well at Matouche Magic. Um, but email address is going to be Nathan dot at focus dot org. 
So Nathan.Matouche at Focus.org. Uh, the best way to reach me. And then, um, yeah, from there, I'd love to uh, I'd, I'd love to just share my story. You know, that's just kind of what this is about. You know, my testimony, you know, how, how Jesus came into my life and how he changed mine. You know, I want to transfer that to uh to other people you know college nice. students and you know people that support me so well i i wish you the best of luck god bless you for this and uh we will we will talk m- uh, again about this before you head off on your mission yeah jimmy i i'm honored to talk about it, especially on this show uh man we've had we've had a great ride and um you know i'm looking forward to my new mission here with uh, with christ but uh Always going to remember the Matouche magic at, at the crossroads, my friend. Oh, uh, you are always welcome back, too, to work the Matouche magic. <laughs> Nathan Matouche, everybody, producer extraordinaire here on Jimmy at the Crossroads. Why don't I give Nathan a moment to share what he's up to? Because like, this is a brand new mission, and it truly is a mission and a calling. And, you know, he's been here for us um, off and on over the past year and a half here on Jimmy at the Crossroads, almost a year and a half, not quite, and always is just such, he's got such a great heart, and he is a very, he knows what his values and his principles are, and it's always been a course best charted by himself because he's following those callings and values and principles. Talking politics, great for generations, oh, what makes I got Jimmy at the crossroads, making sense out of no, no sense. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> <laughs>